DRealize Operations Workload Optimization lets you automate the business and operational intent in your data centers. It can provide benefits like driving better application performance, improving consolidation ratios, adhering to SLA tiering, ensuring data center compliance, or even lowering costs through license enforcement. Workload optimization can be configured within the workload optimization screen by accessing the operational intent, business intent, and optimization recommendation widgets. In this video, we will discuss configuring your operational intent. Select the data center or custom data center you wish to configure, then click on the edit button for operational intent. The first thing to configure is your target utilization objective. This dictates how much vRealize operations will move workloads between the clusters in the data center to best optimize it. The default setting of moderate means workloads will only be moved when a cluster is facing resource contention. Setting it to balance means workloads are evenly spread across the clusters to drive the best possible performance in the data center. On the other hand, with a consolidation setting, workloads are placed to maximize utilization to lower data center costs. This is sometimes called densification. The other configuration that needs to be set up is cluster headroom, which allows you to specify how much risk is acceptable. Workload optimization will move workloads between clusters in the data center, and the headroom setting says when a cluster should be considered full. It provides a buffer of space to reduce the risks from bursts or unexpected resource demand in the cluster. Once both of these are set, you simply click Save to commit the settings. For more information, on configuring workload optimization, please watch the other business intent and optimization recommendation videos.